And welcome back guys. So we're going to continue playing Dying Light 2. And we're going to be doing bizarre questing that we kind of screwed up the whole Peacekeeper main questing. So we'll have to use that, uh, do the Peacekeeper main questing, like all that stuff for round 3. When we go and play this again in round 3 and just do nothing but Peacekeeper stuff. So... Welcome back. That's what's going on with the titles. Why it's no longer Peacekeeper driven, it's now Bizarre driven. Um, learn as you play, you'll find out the hard way eventually. Anyways, make sure you hit that like button, make sure you support button. Let's go ahead and see what we're getting into. So, we need more stamina, I believe, before we do this one. Because there is blowing that wind turbine the first time around. Oh my goodness. It was a nightmare and a half just getting up there. And back then, you didn't know you could just hold the space bar. We all thought you just had to jump and grab and didn't know that you could just hold space bar and you'd be fine. So, let's go ahead and do this side quest, level up, try to get some more inhibitors. I think that's going to be the best thing we can do right now. So, let's do this one. Which is really, really right there. Should be pretty easy. So, let's get into it. Make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you hit the support button. Hello? Anybody there? Damien sent me. Hello? What do you want? Damien sent me. He said you have work here. Wrong address, bud. But I just talked to him. Damien, he sent me here. You alone? Yeah, I'm alone. You'd better be. Now get in and head downstairs. They'll explain everything. Maiden, Damien sent me. I'm uh, here for the job. Right. So, you're new around here. Damien asked that too. What difference does it make? Boss asked a question. Now, I'm still trying to figure out why I'm here. Yeah, you're the one dancing around the subject. Okay. Let's talk about the job then. To do it. It's best that you're not all that well-known around the bazaar. Well, I wouldn't say I'm all that well-known. That's good. That's very good. Looks like we finally found our missing person. Wait, what are you talking about? What do you want from me? Let's just say we work for someone that's dying to meet you. Except he won't be the one dying, I don't think. <laughs> Let's haul him in, boys. <clears throat>
Die? God, you asshole! You set me up! What? No, no, no! I, I swear, I, I would never! I, I was just doing my job! Scouting! It's my job! Who are these people? And why were they looking for me? I don't know, Aiden! You gotta believe me! Please! They just told me to send them anyone who seemed new. They didn't tell me why. I don't have any other choice but to do as they say. They have anything to do with Lucas's death. What? No. I mean... God, I... I hope not. That would be... terrible. But I swear, I don't know. So you've sent others before me, and, and then they've all been murdered? What have you done, Damien? I didn't know. At first. But... I couldn't do anything about it once I found out. I couldn't! How many, Damien? How many people have you sent to their death? Stop it, Aiden, stop! I'm sorry! I had to! I'm trapped! Believe me! They have my brother! Your brother? I talk, fast. They took him and threatened to kill him if I didn't do what they said. I just figured if I did good, they'd eventually release him. I'm being played, and I'm tired of it. I just want my brother back. Will you help me find him? You sent me to the slaughter, and now I'm supposed to forget that and help you find your brother. You're mad. I get it. But look at it this way. He may have heard why they're looking for you. If he could tell you, wouldn't you want to find him? <sighs> All right, fine then. But you better pray that he knows something. I've been there already and searched the place. No sign of Cliff. Serious? Oh, shit. You don't think that... He's not dead, is he? Don't jump to conclusions. But where could they be keeping him? Damn it, this is all my fault. I'm such a fool. Sending people here? That's on you. As for your brother, I'm not certain. And where did you last see him? We were in East Corrie and close to Devil's Bridge when they attacked us. They took him hostage and have been using me to carry out their orders ever since. I only did this to keep my brother alive, Aiden. I didn't know others would die when this started. And I guess I'll search the area around Devil's Bridge for clues. Hey, you serious? You do that for me? <laughs> Not a chance. I'm doing this so that no one else dies because of you. Uh, maybe... Uh, I I'm sure he's still alive. Alrighty. So, where are we going? So, I definitely want to get these two inhibitors. I want to do as many side quests over here as possible, because that's going to help me level up. It's also going to help build stamina, get stuff that we need. So, we'll do this. <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys for supporting the channel, even when I was really sick and, and I'll need some downtime. Yeah. It's a nice change, not playing VR chat, and, you know, playing something that's single player. It's a nice change. I like it. And I'll doing the same crap over and over again, like playing VR chat nonstop, or, you know, just sometimes you gotta step back and. You know, I'll not play multiplayer games. 
sometimes you just gotta take that infinite free day. It's just like, ugh. Mind you, what it's like without having internet or having a cell phone or having power. What it's like, it could be like. I know a lot of people are like, oh, hey, I'm not. Decisive. We have a deal. Let's sort for this stuff soon. Not yet. Happy to try. Should probably go to sleep after this one. Definitely. Uh, so I do all my content creation at nighttime when it's nice and cold. Same thing with house cleaning. Then I just sleep during the day. Been looking for that. Currently, that Come could back change. Later. Even if it's true, so what? For those that actually had a crypto mine, and oh, you get lucky. <laughs> get in the market to do cryptocurrency. <laughs> Do that cryptocurrency cash to USD and don't have to do work. causing damage to your character and it won't let you hit with a collider the collision box kind of annoying although it does seem that dying light 2 is getting more buggy when they do updates most people won't go out of their way to report the issue because it's just too much of a pain in the ass too usually Usually the case. Alright, so if I jump here... Can I get up there? No. I'm gonna have to go this way? Okay. Oh. Oh. I do house cleaning or stuff that requires you to physically move around or concentrate during the day when it's hot when you can do it at night when it's nice and cold. Makes more sense. Oh, that's a zombie.
Just making sure it's the purple one I want. Okay, we got a zombie down there. Got some zombies in there. This one would be better for a mall top. I got refuel on this stuff. So I'm allowed to use five. Good to hear it's not gonna be zombies we're facing in here. Why are we actually in here for? up there.
That was not part of the plan. <clears throat> oh, okay, so that them. That's Mike Burnley and Mike and Bob King. Damien? Damien? Nah, I'm Cliff. Wow, resemblance is uncanny. Guards! Wait, stop, Damien sent me. How did you escape? Escape? I have no reason to escape, man. So you're not, you're working with them, aren't you? Well, duh. Listen, Cliff, what I really wanna know right now is about the murder of Commander Lucas. The PK commander? What about him? Did you or your people kill him? No fucking way. We're not suicidal. Anyway, we got bigger fish to fry. Like you, for instance. Me? What the hell do you mean? You and Damien haven't figured it out? Oh, well. I love my brother, but he's a dope. Always has been. Damien? Damien, Aiden here. Do you read me? Over. Did you find Cliff? Yeah, but he... Uh... Hey, bro. You were a huge help sending all those kids. You've made Dr. Waltz mighty happy. Waltz? He's the boss here. Boss? Cliff? What? I, I don't understand. Yeah. They took me, but I joined the team right quick. Had to pretend they were gonna kill me to get you in line and following orders. You did... what? Don't be a baby about it. It was the only way to make you behave. How could you do this to me? To all those kids you made me drag in. To their deaths. Don't worry about it, bro. It was all for the greater good. Whose greater good? The boss's, of course. And just now, you served up the guy the boss wanted most. That's him, fellas. The one who took the doc's toy. Oh, Cliff? Fuck! What? What are you saying? The doc's gonna be thrilled. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
Damien. Hey, are you still there? Come in, Damien. God, can you hear me? Ceiling access, okay. Good to know. Access that way. Guessing. Okay, control the way it came in. Which is always fun. I think I'm going to spare you guys with me going to resupply. Let's see here, I'm going to go this way. That moment when you see them doing supports like that, that never is a good thing for a build. Why is it never a good thing? Just means this building's ready to collapse. That's all it means. Hey, right, look, there's some zombies. I got stuck in the hole. Oh, thank goodness we can actually resupply and stuff. Um, I'm actually going to do this in reverse. I'm going to come over here and then go over there. Yeah! Away empty. What you want? <sighs> no bows and no mollies for sale. But they do have alcohol, which is always good. Fan of PK gear, huh? You made this peacekeeper mighty happy. Also, stuff I didn't want to. My window's always open for you. All right, let's go take a look over here real quick. Hey, you! I love conducting business at the Metro. Hmm. Who doesn't need one of those?
I have to do a bunch of grinding anyways just to get a bunch of this so that I can easily make stuff when I'm in that squeeze. So every single one of those yellow bushes, I'm going to have to go around the map to each one of them. And the only way those reset is over time or if you exit the game. So <laughs> yeah. Be able to make your own med kits or immune boosters and a squeeze is always a good thing. But whoever carved the skin, how do I man, do this? Uh, from what Harvey told me, it goes this way. Uh oh. Uh, Ow. Uh, Ow. Uh, 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 all right. Uh, that was close. Uh, Let's go ahead and use one of these. We That boy would turn things around. My woman's gone mad. I'm supposed to sell you, my dear goat. What you got against you? I like it. Damien, I've never seen this whole bunch of jobs so badly in my life. Maybe there's a way to fix this. No mollies, you bastard. The reason I said it is because he's not selling. What's that blue? Swimming boost. I want electrical shock protection. That's the alcohol. Okay. Come on, Nathan, go to that. Wait, wait, wait. What's, what's going on? Where's Damien? He locked himself in the tower. Any other way into the tower? Not really. Not by ordinary means. People have tried to climb the wall, but those who have usually end up getting scraped off the ground. Yeah, I'll give it a shot. Well, this will be a first. I've never actually climbed this church. Alrighty. And it's becoming nighttime, but even worse. Okay, let's 
this looks a little more promising. Improvise. I never noticed that there's gap lining up there. It pays to have stamina. Guessing this quest requires like more stamina or something, maybe. No, it doesn't have to say. It feels like it needs more stamina. up there and then jump over there maybe? Let's try it. <clears throat> well, I have definitely never been in this tower because this is all new to me. As far as I know of. <sighs> Get down my comfort level. One mess up and you gotta do it all again from scratch. Please help me cl make me climb all the way down this. Damien, stop or I jump! Wait, okay. I've stopped. Relax, Damien. Let's both relax. What do you want? To talk. About what? About not finding out the hard way that you can't fly. 
Maybe if I weren't such a weakling and a coward, I'd have jumped already. But you didn't. Something is holding you back. Fear. Fear has always held me back. It held me back from refusing those assholes after they took my brother. It held me back from telling those doomed guys to run like hell instead of sending them to their deaths. I won't be held back anymore, Aiden. I won't hold myself back. You ready for this, Aiden? Because if I stop holding myself back, I think I just might be able to fly after all. Check it out! No! Wow. That's an interesting ending. The last time I was doing that quest, they had uh, those bandits, the renegades, in there. So around, they had different bandits in there. All right, uh, I wonder what the easiest way is down. I'm gonna make me go down. Ooh. Without going splat. Preferably without going splat. Oh, oh. oh thank you. This is auto connects you to the zip line. I'm sitting there. Please just connect. Damn, they broke this game when they updated now, didn't they? That's not supposed to be out yet. The ball's in your court. While looking for a job, I met that. Uh, find missing supplier. Really? They're gonna make me walk all the way over there. Alrighty. We should sleep off night time. Why that window's not open right now? Mm. The amount of rain and thunder I'm seeing out there and lightning. <sighs> Woo! It's cold. If I was open that window right now, it'd be like 55 degrees in the house. I'm just like, mm, nah, no, no, good. <laughs> All those bells going off it kind of reminds me a little bit of that little farm ranch they used to live on. Sometimes I wake up at night and get the fall even after. Because that's all you would hear in the morning is roosters and people announcing breakfast, and I'd be like, What? What are you talking about? Something funky. <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> 
Well, that was an interesting twist. <laughs> I guess we can try doing this one. I don't think we have enough stamina for it, though. I really don't think we do. Oops. Let's get attacked. We have water. If only that boy would turn things around. Good morning, Pilgrim. Have I already thanked you for for the water? I hear you were robbed. But my best friend, no less. I'm devastated, really. And why on earth would you jump to that conclusion about your best friend? I didn't want to, but who else could it be? She was storing it for me, to keep it safe, she said. And now, it's conveniently gone. Me and my boy are left with nothing. If only she'd admit it and return the flower, I'd forgive her, I swear I would. Lord is my witness, if she's in trouble, I'll help her. But she's a stubborn one. We've had quite a harvest, too. Wouldn't have had us living on Easy Street, but now... Now we'll starve. Do you have any proof that Anna did this? Not exactly, but was in her shed, wasn't it? And here I thought she was doing me a favor offering to store it. Turns out she was just making it easier for her to screw over me and my boy. <sighs> Talk to her, would you? She won't listen to me. Maybe a stranger could get around her stubbornness. We can put this behind us if she gives it back. And if she stole it because she was hungry, she can keep what she needs. Her shed's near the water tower. Please, go talk to her. So I'm gonna go I'll do this quest. It. And then I'll end the video there. A friend's betrayal hurts the most. I try to keep the videos down 30, 40 minutes, but like I said, it's very difficult to do that. Especially with quests being so long, long and you don't have fast travel unlocked, you know. It really changes if it's going to be easy or not. Hey, Anna? Anna, I just want to talk. Talk to me and I'll go away. It won't take long. Look, I know Teresa sent you. Fuck her and fuck you.
to put this one on the ground. Guess we'll do this one round. Oh, it's gonna make me climb this damn tower again. <laughs> Can we please talk? I'd like to help. Help what? Remind me of my poverty? My drinking problem? Or that I'm a heinous flower thief? I'm not making assumptions. I just want to hear your story. I want to hear the truth. The truth? You want the truth? Here's the truth. I would never rob a friend. Never. And that's the end of my story. Did Teresa tell you about the half year's wages she owes me? I needed Teresa to sell that flower so she could pay me. Why would I risk everything? My well-being, Teresa, and her sons, by stealing it. She'd mentioned you were storing the flower. I figured it was the best way to keep watch over it and make sure I got paid. So we put it in my shed near the tower. I went to check on it this morning and nothing. All gone. You didn't see anyone lurking nearby or anything suspicious? You don't think I would have mentioned that by now? I can only tell you that I did not steal that flower. I wouldn't do that to Teresa or to myself. The only strange thing was that nothing else was stolen. My buckwheat, my beets, untouched. Whoever it was only wanted the flower. Interesting. Mind if I go check out the shed? Maybe it just needs to be looked at with a fresh pair of eyes. Knock yourself out. People this close shouldn't hurt each other. <laughs> Doors unlocked. Somebody must have... Nothing's broken. Someone was very familiar with this place. The rest of the supplies are untouched. They knew exactly what they were looking for. set of shoes. Thief worked alone. Flower trail on the ground. Bags dragged this way. keys to the shed me and my husband nobody else you're sure there's no sign of forced entry Anna whoever took the flower had the keys or made copies so you do think it was me calm down and think who else would do this and why help me help you unless Teresa's right after all Hard to tell. Someone from the bazaar, perhaps? There's Dodger. That guy's capable of anything. And then there's Benny, Teresa's son. And that's all I can come up with. Who's this Dodger you mentioned? He's a snake, that's why. One of the shadiest characters in the bazaar. Come to think of it. He took an interest in Teresa's grain harvest recently. Asked a lot of questions. Never paid any mind before. I should talk to him. You'll find him at the bazaar, but watch your back. He doesn't give a rat's ass about people. Just money. What about Teresa's son? Why would he do this? Normally, I wouldn't suspect him. Nice kid. I've known him all his life. He's like a son to me. 
But lately, he's been quiet, like he's got something to hide. And maybe he does. But no, Benny wouldn't have done this. It would break Teresa's heart, and he knows it. And even if he had taken the flower, why? That seems to be the central question for everyone involved. Where can I find Benny? Not sure. He's been making himself pretty scarce. That said, I'm sure Teresa's got him guarding their storehouses. Make sure what meager goods they have left are safe. I'll look for him. Since you helped my husband, I'll share a secret with you. The storehouses are full of traps. So be careful. My shed has nothing of the sort, which is probably why it was so easy to steal from. And as for Benny, Teresa keeps close tabs on her son. Ask her. Can you tell me where you were the night the flower was stolen? At home with my husband. There's not much more to say. And not much more? Or nothing? Nothing. I was home with my husband. End of story. Accusations are devastating enough around here. I'm ruined. And not if we find the flower and prove it was someone else. Perhaps. But in my experience, the damage has been done. Maybe, maybe not. Let's see what I can find out. All right. I'm finished. There is no <laughs> What's up with the blowing out the car side? Yikes. All righty. Hey, hi, what's up? And all the way over there, just to be I told I have to go all the way back. Lovely, right? Keep up on the third degree. And it just look at me now. I'm hitting trees. Wish I had some tomatoes. Or garlic. Or even a carrot. Zip lines are definitely helpful. Time to farm soon. You don't have anything, you have no alcohol. I need more alcohol. Looks <sighs> like I'm gonna have to farm. Dodger? Well, well, the pilgrim himself. Here's a piece of advice. The next time you offer someone water, ask if they're thirsty first. What's your problem? My problem is a whole tank of agua fresca that nobody wants to buy anymore. Just want to ask you a few questions. Are you shitting me? Do I look like an information booth? I've got a business to run here. You don't have business? Then get out of my face. Teresa's flower was stolen, and I want to find out who did it. Teresa's flower was... What the fuck? Okay, you've got my attention. What do you know about a woman named Anna? What, the one who works for Teresa? Not all that much. Her husband sometimes sits in on our card games. He never said boo about her. Not even a few pints in. That says something right there. You know where Benny might be? Do I look like his mother? 
Believe me, he's on top of my where are they now list. He went down in flames in our last card game. He almost literally bet the farm. And lost. So if you're looking for that flower, it's not Teresa's or Benny's no more. It's mine. The kid owed it to me. And if it's missing, it was stolen from me. Aha. Uh -huh. So Benny's in your debt. Big time. Up to his ears, you might say. In flower. You think he stole it? Could be. He's a dumb kid who might think that will stop me from trying to collect. I need to find him then. Ask Mother Teresa. She's usually got the boy on a short leash. Except for poker nights, clearly. So now you know I have the most skin in this game. If that flower isn't found, I am the big loser. So maybe check out Teresa's storehouses. Hmm, seems like just the place a dumb kid like Benny would think he could hide. And if you do get your hands on the flower, just kindly bring it straight to me. I'll pay you handsomely for the service, of course. But it will save everyone a lot of grief, and... Hey, I get my flower. We can put this behind us. About time, so wow, he's coming. Okay, we'll do this last mission here. Home free. I bet you it's gonna be in the warehouse two. I'll go over here to warehouse one. Do it real quick. I'll definitely have to empty up my inventory so I can pick more stuff. I'll volunteer to do the cleaning. She built the axe. Such a princess. Getting splinters in her delicate fingers. If that's her Lock from inside. It's definitely a trap thing. You hear that shit? Oh. This floor doesn't look safe. Maybe there's another way. as warehouses go. Yeah. <laughs> 
have any more house too. Hey, what the fuck are you doing here? Is that you, Pilgrim? You shouldn't be here, mate. How'd you get in? You're Benny, right? We need to talk. I don't like this. Dodger sent you, did he? Tell him I'm pulling together what I owe him. I'm just... I just haven't got it yet. Hold up, Benny. Only you had a reason to steal the flower. You bastard. Do you think that just because you turn on the water, you got free run of the place? Tell me I'm wrong. I ain't telling you nothing. Fuck <sighs> off. Benny. <laughs> Never done that quest either. Telling everyone we should be getting ready for winter. Open that chest. That's close. Itself on third playthrough for peacekeepers. Don't give the bizarre one. That's not fair. It's 
So it's literally just the action of giving the wire to the Vizar is what screwed up the Peacekeeper questing. Completely forgot about it. Unfortunately, this game auto saves. So every time you sleep, it saves. Every time you get through a certain portion of the game, it saves. So otherwise known as very annoying. I mean, it's good, but it's also bad if you don't really want to save. Don't have stamina. I find out. Where are you, Benny? Hopping through, I see one. I can go over there and destroy that tower. <laughs> gotcha. First, answer a few questions, but I want the truth. Did you steal the flower? No, I don't even know where it is. So why did you attack me? Thought you might have been one of Dodger's boys, come to collect. I see. You are in deep with Dodger and used your mother's bountiful harvest for collateral. I was hot that night, mate, and the pot was big enough we could have bought the Jansen's fields. With the water back on and all, Mum and me would have been sitting pretty for the rest of our days. But then things got ugly and... Ain't no other way to tell it. I lost. So did Dodger take the flower? To settle up? Doubt it. Could have just made me bring it to him. And I would have. He's too lazy to do anything himself. But you know, mate, don't tell him I said that. What's the meaning of this? Your son's a thief. I'm bringing him to the guards for a chat. Unless he'll say where he hid the flower. Right now. I told you, mate. I didn't do it. Of course he didn't. Are you daft? Now, this will be a bitter pill, I'm sure. But all signs are pointing to your son. Especially the most important sign of all. He had a motive. Now, time to come clean, Benny. Tell your mother about your debt. The card game you lost. Please. You really think I don't know what's going on with my own son? He has nothing to do with this. Let him go. I'll be the one confessing here. We worked for months on that crop. Worked our fingers to the bone. It yielded enough to last for months. There'd be bread, enough to feed the whole bazaar. But you know what Dodger would do if he got it? Sell it back to us for triple the price. We'd end up paying for our own flour. A cruel joke. All because of a stupid card game. We'd be ruined. I couldn't allow that. I wouldn't. So, where is the flower? Under the water tower. You must understand, it can't go to Dodger. And why not? He wanted fair and square. Dodger? Fair and square? Hardly. He's a cheat. Everyone knows it. We just can't prove it. Okay. Say you're right. Is there a middle ground? Can we give him something else instead? Someone like Dodger doesn't seem all that flexible. He's gotta be, mate. Talk to him, please. Ask him for more time. 
anything. We're begging you. Uh, let me think about that. You are our only hope. Don't get mad. Can't wait to go to sleep. I'm one of those kinds. I don't stop until the mission's done. All right. Oh, this has gone way longer than expected. I was shooting for 40 or 50 minutes. It's turned into an hour and 20 minutes. Yikes. So I'm going to go back to the bazaar here. Settle the debt with Dodger. And then I'm saving and I'm going to bed for a little bit. Uh, hope everyone's enjoying the videos. I'll try my best to keep them small. But sometimes you can't keep them small. It's just as bad as that. Cyberpunk 20, 2077 sometimes. reason I use Cyberpunk 2077 as a reference, those missions were fucking long. Kind of like this. <sighs> Only difference is with 20, uh, Cyberpunk 2077, it was really buggy. If you're tried playing on Corpo mode, you experienced some heavy glitching. But if you did the uh, No Man or Street Kid, you did fine. It just didn't see as many glitches. <laughs> it was a good decision of staying up all night. Filming some gameplay because it is yeah. like thundering and lightning outside. I just looked out the window, I saw a big ass flash. I'm like, we might not lose power today. This was a good time to do some recording. Some gameplay. Ooh, this is humming. I had a webcam right now. I would show you what's going on outside this window. I am not going outside to get the mail today. <laughs> oh my goodness, we have so much stuff to sell. I'll do this afterwards. Come on, Aiden, go to the Okay, let's make things lively. 100 more. No freaking way. Unless you're willing to cut the time by 10 seconds. Deal. Living dangerously. It was already an impossible task. Well, we'll see about that. Aiden, you find my flower yet? Yeah, that's what I'm here about. Teresa and Benny are in dire straits. Can you forgive their debt, or at least give them more time? Fuck that. How many times do I have to say I'm not running a charity? I didn't force Benny to play cards. You know, a man can't pay his debts well. <laughs> He's not a man, is he? Stupid is as stupid does. Maybe when they got nothing left but the skivvies on their butts, they'll have learned a valuable lesson. You know what, Aiden? Actually... Yeah, I think I got something to help everyone. Honestly, yeah, who cares about flour? What, am I going to be a baker all of a sudden? <laughs> I don't think so. But I do want what I'm owed. And me and Urban, we've got this bet. Wait, whoa, whoa, no fair, not him. 
He runs on walls. Of course it's fair. There's no rule against having him get them. You pull this off, Aiden, and what Urban will have to pay me will more than cover my losses on the flower. And there'll be extra I can throw your way. Wait, what exactly are you talking about here? You see, on top of the church, there's this, uh, well, let's just call it a flag. You can't see it from the ground, but this flag, well, it's, it's not a flag. Yeah, you'll know when you see it. Urban and I made a bet that I could find someone who could nab it for us. I've been raising the stakes for years, and Urban's called me every time. But with the amount on the line now, you know it would be a sin not to give it a try. Uh, I'm in no hurry. Rather you just keep raising the stakes till it gets real juicy. What's that? <laughs> Fear suddenly got you all puckered. Nah, I, I'm just looking out for you. It'll ruin you if you lose now, being out the flower and all. Well, I'm game if Aiden is. The time limit's pretty fucking brutal, but, you know, I've got faith in Aiden here. So, you in? Let's yeah, do this. Sure. Well, then let's just get to it, shall we? Three, two, one, go. Andale, Aiden. Make me proud. I wasn't expecting to do it now, but okay. <laughs> bad timing. Why is it bad timing? It is thundering and lightning outside, and I could be powered any second. <laughs> Faster. Don't have time. I know it says we have four minutes, but it still takes a hot minute to get up there. That hurts. Andy challenge has been conquered. Way to go, Aiden. All right, all right. Don't get so excited. You're ugly when you gloat, you know that? So you'll cancel Teresa and Benny's debt now? Like it never existed. And you, my new friend, you saved the day. Take this with my thanks.
All right. I'm going to go save my game now. <laughs> Before I lose power. And I'm going to end the video right here. I meant for the video to be like 40, 50 minutes. It ended up being an hour and something. I think it's hour 30, 35 minutes maybe right now. Anyways, make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you hit the support button. I'll see you guys soon. After I get my sleep time in, I'll go back to doing some more recording of Dying Light 2. Anyways, make sure you hit the like button. Make sure you support one. I'll see you guys again soon.